How to solve the parallel connection of lithium battery packs in electric vehicles or home energy storage systems. Conventional lithium battery packs are connected in parallel. A set of batteries is fully charged with 54 volts. The other set is half a volt. The positive electrodes of the two sets of lithium batteries are connected to the positive electrodes. The P-negative electrode is connected to the P-negative electrode. The front meter detects the current. It can be seen that the parallel mutual charging flow displayed by the front flow meter has reached about 500 amps. This current exceeds the tolerance range of the protective plate and the battery. It will damage the lithium battery and pose a hidden danger. Next, we connect the storage protection plate with the current limiting module to the battery. The positive electrode is connected to the positive electrode. The P-negative electrode is connected to the P-negative electrode. Parallel connection completed. You can see that the current value of the front current meter is 500 in an instant. The back is limited to 5 amps of current. The pressure difference of the two sets of batteries divided by the internal resistance of the two sets of batteries is equal to the parallel mutual charging flow. That is to say, the larger the capacity of the battery, the higher the magnification the lower the internal resistance, the greater the mutual charge flow. After the two sets of lithium batteries are equipped with a protective plate with a parallel flow function, it can be used in parallel. The premise is that the type of battery, such as ternary, iron, lithium, and a number of strings should be the same. Just a reminder. If there is no communication parallel requirement, taking care of conventional intelligent protection boards with limited viewership of parallel, connections can also fulfill parallel requirements.